Hey guys, <laughs> we got the stuff. We're going to Lake Bled. What's up guys, it's actually the next day because we arrived when it was pretty dark outside so I didn't feel like filming, we just kind of chilled inside and took some night photos but yeah, here's the view of the whole place, um, as you can see, mountains and stuff, very beautiful, this is our place, they're scary doing BTS, we're gonna go to the lake now and hopefully get some fire content, so we'll see you there. What's up guys? We are by the lake right now and we're gonna make a super chill beat. Very sleepy for my next album. So yeah, let's go guys. Let's see, let's start off with some analog lab. Let's find some really dreamy pads and then we'll see how it moves from there. And we need something like really... Tokyo Dreams is always a good one, but... Mm. That's too big. Okay, I really like that one. Let's do this one. Probably use this in another beat, but let's set a tempo of like 70. That works. I think I was, I was doing F7, F7, and then D7. And then C7. Alright, perfect. Let's record notes and automation. Three, two, one, go. Okay, that could work. Let's see how long we did it for. Oh, perfect almost. Let's turn off this. Make them all a bit longer. So that they all work really well. And then we can do like higher note here. Then we can take these and move them a bit across so that there's more variety, I guess. Let's pitch it up a bit, see how that works. I like that a lot, it's fire. I'll add some uh, reverb. It's perfect. All right, let's add some bells to it or something. Okay, we can do something like that. Let's lower it though, like make it real quiet. Yeah, that's like an interesting little thing. It's just kind of like 
very dreamy, spacious, once I add everything to it. Lots of reverb. Let's put up the gain as well. And let's add the delay, of course. Let's make it ping pong. I like that. Yo, this is cinematic lo-fi, that's how it's made. Now let's add soft soul bass, per usual. It can go really simple. Since it's like... It's just a very like cinematic like little sound. And then we can just chop it so it starts again here, 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 here. Have y'all put reverb on a bass before? It's crazy. Just re EQ the top. We need another like electric pan or something to fill it up because it needs a little more structure to it I guess. Not like I can- wait let's add launch lizard instead. Let me copy the same chords, paste them here. You see it adds a little bit extra to it. Is that it? I feel like the, this could be a bit faster though. Let me just make it as more like chords. So yeah, you kind of just want to strum the notes kind of randomly. Um, of course, with practice you'll know what kind of randomly means, but um, yeah, it just it's pretty easy to catch on to how to do this. Perfect, look at this. Let's add some RC20 on the uh, roads to give it that really vintage lo fi vibe. Okay, can we can do something with this. We could do something like that. And for this, let's uh, make it... So here's my idea with this. It doesn't sound great, right? But... We're gonna make it super, super delayed and it'll just be texture in the background. That's what I was trying to do with it. Look, um, maybe like, yeah, keep it default. Look at it, look at this.
guys. Probably gonna leave it off of here. Of course, I'm gonna arrange it, mix it, and actually finish. Maybe add some more elements to it. But for now, this is what we got. A super cinematic track in a super cinematic location. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I'll catch you later. Yeah.